Hello everybody, welcome to the round of 48, round of, season 48, round of 64 match between Crystal Hunter and Doom Adan. Crystal Hunter's uh, tentacle Nurgle versus Doom Adan's woodies. Uh, pretty crazy woodies, he's got a, an Adj 6 catcher with nothing else. <laughs> a strength 4 Adj 5 dancer, a strength 4 Lino, move up tree. And uh, an Ange 5 catch up. Lots of injuries as well. Move 7 there. He's got Eldril. He's got a Wizard. He's got a Baby. He's down loads of TV. Because Chunter's team is insane. 2,400 TV or something. Um, and it's a weird team. There's no guard. Which is obviously fine against against Woodies. Um, only got the one one guard on a Warrior. And one guard on a Beast. And this is a, a Dakar. Amazing. Oh, I, I'm already a big fan of Doomadan. Incredible. Dakaring against a team with five tentacles is, uh... Oh, the disrespect. Glorious pass. Um, well, can't do spoilers, eagle eaglets. But this is going for YouTube. Um, this is going for YouTube. So, this will be out before that match. Um, but something happened in overtime. It was, it was good. <laughs> <laughs> was it? I don't know. Something happened. <laughs> Whether it was good or bad depends. I don't. I can't spoil us. Yes, Dadle. Do you want to? Do you want to come in? And it, but it, it's just basically it's just a generic. It's a generic uh, Nurgle team, except he's replaced guard with tentacles, which is uh, interesting. It's really good when it gets ahead. But it's got to roll dice to get ahead because it, he hasn't got he took juggernaut into the piling on which you know who am i to say if that's good or absolutely terrible um but i can tell you it's absolutely terrible <laughs> because it's not piling on <laughs> um, but yeah pretty much just standard and he's, he's got this weird dirty play sneaky kit but it's like He's just trying to high roll people, and if he high rolls, then obviously once they get on top, this team's incredible with five tentacles. Um, the problem is, you've got to roll dice to get on top. And those dice will be shit because there's not that much removal skills. I yes. mean, for a Nurgle team. For a Nurgle team, and Hancock's here as well, hello. Hello, uh, I'll Aww. try and be impartial. Glorious Hancock. <laughs> oh god. Oh god, I've just realized it's Hancock. What do you mean? If you didn't watch this uh, live on Dimmy's match, then you won't know why it's funny that it's Hancock, but <laughs> there you go, it's Hancock. <laughs> it, no, I didn't, so I don't. <laughs> he said something Sorry. and got told off, but. I'm know. a big meanie. Big meanie. Oh, okay. Big, big meanie. Big meme. Well, we did. We did know that part. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everyone knows he's a big meanie. It doesn't. <laughs> not much of a story, is it? Oh, oh nice guy. Guy. Rebel spy was too Yeah, oh, sorry. Wow, instant removal. Woo Rick, by the way. Woo Rick. Woo. What a legend. This is a, a straight. Oh, he was GFIing to foul. This is a, a strange Dakar defense from Chunter, isn't it? Some might say it's not a defense at all. <laughs> uh, we've been talking something about holes uh, a lot in the past here. <laughs> I, I can see. I can see holes. <laughs> you can see a gaping hole, can you? Is there frenzy on the team? No. It's interesting that there's so much tentacles, and yet there's like a wide gap where there are no tentacles. Yeah. He didn't even go through it either. He could have just walked through oh, it, but, yeah. but this gets him further away from the beast and stuff, which is nice, isn't it? Like, yeah. yeah. It's a bit rowdy. Um, like, it is a block piece, doing that with the ball. Like, yeah, you got the hypno gaze, so I guess it's fine. But even like... If you get the one nine there, you have to GFI with the ball, right? No, I, I, would, I would have not gone for it this turn. I think this was too round, way too rowdy. Because um, like it's there is a gaping hole, but it's just a bit too deep, isn't it? Like I don't really yeah, want to go through. It, it is too deep. Um, 
But it would have encouraged me that, that this turn was so bad that there'd be another bad turn later, so I wouldn't try and take advantage of it. <laughs> yes. <laughs> But as I, it is... That's harsh, but <laughs> also, also true. It's just how I think, yeah. It's literally how I think, you know. Like, yeah. Yeah. Um, but this, we can get the beast on the ball here, like, super easy. Barely an inconvenience, but doesn't get the yeah. power. Maybe should have re-rolled that, genuinely. I... Yeah. I... Yes. Because, like, it's a nav six, and you get your killer to, like, kill it, and you get the beast on the ball. I... I think there's just way too much upside. Mm. That's a lot of upside. Especially as this team is like a kind of team that wants to high roll and then, you know, real yeah. that would have killed, like that killed Eldril. The next hit killed Eldril, so <laughs> we right. might have killed him. Killing Eldril is pretty good though, so. It is, yeah. <laughs> I hate Eldril. Absolutely standard old rule, by the way. First time he gets punched, he dies. <laughs> yep. Yeah, pretty normal. <laughs> did he did he activate the beast and it was stupid again, or did he run out of time? He lost dodge. Did he literally run out of time, or what? Oh, yeah, that's super weird. I didn't see him try Certainly, that. Certainly, um, dice lock. See if, it's, if he rolls for it or not. Oh, well, uh, yeah, really stupid. Yeah, he rolled a one. Yeah, so he did the last one, rolled a one, right, and then did a five right. plus for tentacles. Yeah. So. So, yeah, the beat is this shit. <laughs> That's a banana, Jack Ball. I know you. <laughs> you may not know what one of those looks like. <laughs> so you immediately went <laughs> somewhere else, but it is a banana. This is Banana Man, a British institution. <laughs> Um. <laughs> I've not sung Banana Man for a while. It's a shame. Sh I should. Yeah. Glorious. No, oh, I that, is, that was weird, wasn't it? It was weird the like victorious. the gaping hole turn defend. was bad, and then the complete failure to put pressure on him after it was Day, weird, and now it shouldn't like you know. Doom down his miles behind enemy lines, broken through. Yeah. Oh, strange. Like, yeah, and it's just so... It's also not like... The, it's not the worst for Chunter in this situation either, is it? Because he's not, like so far off the pitch that you can probably put quite a bit of pressure on to maybe get the early score. Yes, yeah, I don't I think... Mean, only get the early score here. Um, I don't think this guy should have moved in, right? This guy could have just stayed here. Yeah, as, as a threat. threat. Yeah. Bring other people back, um, and also like little things like he's moved the warrior in for slapping the tree about. I just just moving back a bit. Don't don't need to hit that tree. Yeah, or he's going for the beast. I don't think he's going for the beast base though. That's why. The oh, is it? GFI, yeah. Oh uh, yeah, GFI I mean beast. that's good. Ooh, that is nice. Which makes that wrestle in there nice better. But base. again, he could have he could have gone for the beast first and then moved him in there afterwards, couldn't he? If he'd got there. He just yeah, dodges away. I... Doesn't give a shit. What the Where'd you get your string six beast from, mate? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I was only nine there, and he's fucked as well, right? Yeah, yeah, it was also one in nine dodge, yeah, incredible. No, 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 the blitz is a one in nine. I think the dodge. Yeah, oh, he's at five. No, yeah, he's at five. Yeah, he's at five. So the the dodge was a one in thirty six. But yeah, yeah the, but the the blitz on a, on a wrestle piece is a yeah, one in nine. Bad. But... Also, the, just the like, tentacles minus two strength tentacles is is not something you like, is it? No. Like... <laughs> 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 I mean, just don't give a fuck. That's the only way to deal with it. Yeah, yeah, you've got yeah exactly. And uh, thank you very much, Huanchi, for staying fantastic for eleven glorious months. Banana well, it's man. Not the, it's obviously not the only way to deal with it, but you could deal with it like that. <laughs> yeah, I mean, once he sticks you, I mean, you deal with it by staying seven squares away from him. Yeah. And then once you fail to do that, then... Excuse me, why have we got jokes? Because uh, it's chunter. <laughs> <laughs>
It only just hit me that he's got chugs instead of pile on. Yeah, yeah, I did call it at the start. I said, who can say if it's good or absolutely terrible? <laughs> I can. It's terrible. I mean, it's pretty bad. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it is. Like, it's fine after piling on, sure. Yeah, but yeah, not yeah. Before. 100%. No, no, no. What is he using it for? Wrestle pieces? Oh my um, god. Pretty good foul. Ooh. He's using it for when he needs to uh, smash through the line and make some elf plays. Yeah, I guess so, yeah. You know, like you do on Nurgle team quite a lot. Yes, Nur Nurgle are famously amazing ball handers. <laughs> yeah, and now he scores because the edge fall is just in the middle being able to do something next time. Yeah, I think, um, I mean, I don't hate that the edge four went out there. Like, obviously, Dumadan had to get fucking lucky to get away. Um, since the beast was there. Um, but yes, like, with the beast not there, it's. Yeah, it's pretty Like, see now, right? All right. Chunter has three rerolls for his three turn. Which, like, that's great. But could he have used that reroll way earlier? And been on two now, like, wouldn't that have been a better and then, like, pro possibly not a score at all? Yeah, yeah. maybe. Like, with, with with your re rolls in the first half, you, you can be a bit looser with them, but yeah, I, I think so. And especially, like, you're up against the elves, like, you want your tentacles on the ball every turn, that's why you have tentacles on every, every player. Um, I just think, like, and then, like, getting the best tentacle on the ball, like, that seems very much worth it. Plus, like, the kill attack on the edge six. Yeah, I really like the reroll there, to be honest. It's just, yeah. Um, I mean, I don't, know, I don't play a lot of bash, but to me, that seems quite the obvious time when you're like, all right, super fucking grateful if the neuro player does not reroll that. Yeah. Now, honestly, I don't know what it's for, Sambo Simon, the jugs. It just doesn't make any sense. Like, not before panning on, right? The, the opportunity cost is too high. But, like, it does open up things like, yes, you could blitz and then, like, you'll definitely move them. You won't get hit back. And, you know, you can knock down wrestlers and stuff. And, like, it's, and you can move thing, like move people out of the way if you're trying a three turn score. Like, it might actually be relevant this match. But just panning on is, like, a million times better. Yeah, it's just too, too good value wise. Yeah, it's like it's broken. It's like one of the few broken things in the game. Isn't yeah, it? exactly. Like, yeah. Just to, to deny yourself it, just so you can say, oh, I don't need Clawpum to win, seems uh, foolish. <laughs> that seems like a chunk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a bit too much of a chunk to me, if you ask me. Like his goats, his goats are really nice. Like, you know, the utility goats that he's got are, are nice. But I, I think a lot of the time you can't really afford more than one on Nurgle. To be honest with you, well, I think you can. I think you can have two. Yeah, you can have two. Yeah, sure. yeah, yeah, for sure. Good. But surely, if you if you can have two, you've got to make sure that your two killers are developed. Yeah. At this TV. Yeah. And you don't take drugs. No. You want two killers, whether that's one warrior and one beast, or two beasts. And then you you want a, I I like a fast one and an agile one and he's got both so that's pretty sick. But you could also just have two fast ones. There was a there was a Nurgle team that won a, a major on fumble and he had two movement eight pesticles. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, it's that seems pretty fucking good. Yeah, pretty mental, isn't it? It allows you to play that slow bash game in the middle for a lot longer as well, doesn't it? Yeah. Rather than worrying about space, you just focus on the bash because you got move eight. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, crazy team that was. Well, this is not much of a defense, is it? Not really, but can he put a decent one up? I don't know. No, probably not. It's funny because I like blitzing the defenseless guy there again, like because yeah, I give the so defenseless guy. Yeah, yeah. You get a bit more like room to move not your players only, into as well. Yeah, not only does it open up a lot more, but he's also defenseless. Like, yeah. Why take the extra? Like, it's so high odds to bring him down, but like, when you don't, you're super fucking sad. 
So that's another turn you're not killing elves. Yeah. Yeah, it's just, it just more likely. You're more likely to get through. He hasn't got sidesteps. So, like, you know, if you push him, if you don't get this guy down, he sidesteps him in a better spot as well, doesn't he? So, yeah, I would have definitely yeah. hit the defenseless guy without sidestep. Oh, no. I even forgot that it was three turn. Yeah, you definitely need to hit the. Hit the Get to sidestep, but not the sidestep. Fireball. Oh, that is spicy. I think it was terrible. <laughs> Maybe not though, because he's got the edge five guy, hasn't he? He's got the edge, but the edge six is on tens. Oh, he's just gonna chain. No, he can't chain him off. Oh, because he's. Yeah. Uh, it's... Oh. I mean, not that he's tried to, but I was thinking, you know, if he could chain him off, if he could chain off the straight the tentacles. Must have felt like he was. I mean, he, I suppose he is really far behind in the matchup that he wants to stop him scoring oh, this half. But I don't know if you just save it with the second shit. half and line it up a bit better. I mean, he's got a, such a great team. Like, I know every elf is bust in some way, but also, like, look at all the fucking startups. Like, he should be able to use the wizard to get a score. Uh, yeah. I. I I really hate that fireball. Yeah, I despise it. I mean, there was a lot of value for, like, uh, for attrition. Uh, yeah. Okay, but, like, come on, man. <laughs> you shouldn't be blitzing for attrition. You shouldn't be fireballing for attrition, should you? Wow, GFL no. blitz. Uh, but it can stop the score, I guess. So. I mean, I'll really out and... Mm. There's a KO on a great uh, retriever catcher. Um... His best capture, I think, but still, no. It's just like you have to feel like you're really left in the dust to do that. Here comes another big foul. But I mean, it, it, it is good if it really stops the score by getting everyone down. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, it, 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 he rolled pretty decently on the knockdowns. <laughs> and there was a decent chance of some attrition, to be fair. Yeah. But I, you know, I think maybe no, saving it. I think it's fine. Probably just saw all the juicy players and couldn't resist. Yeah. yeah. I mean, all gods were in there, right? And that's like, yeah, you get a mighty blow hit on every god. I'm sure that's too super. It's just, this isn't ladder anymore. No, it was very, very spicy. But he stopped the score, and you know, now he can just, at the end of the day, now he can just uh, defensive Dakar, and then hope he wins the toss in overtime, right? I mean, yeah. yeah, there is that, but can't you do that anyway? Well, not if he scores, no, because then you'd just lose 2-1, wouldn't you? Like, so at least he used the wizard to stop the score. Whereas, like, if this half, yeah, he's yeah, not going to build it. Yeah, sorry, yeah, if if he actually manages to stop the score there, yeah. Because yeah. now you're not stopping the score because he's got, you know, he's got too many men. Yeah. And he's going to hurt you too much. So, like, you basically, you basically can't stop the score in the second half. You maybe can use it and turn well, him over and score, but you, yeah. you, it's very unlikely you're going to be able to stop the score in this half. Like, very unlikely. He's got I, just, I, just, I just don't think it's that unlikely with all... The, I mean, I guess, like, with all the tentacles, like, trying to retrieve the ball after a, a bolt will be difficult as hell, mm -hmm. and then, like, getting it safe with all the stink, yeah. Yeah, so actually, the more I think about it, maybe the, maybe the wizard isn't that bad. Like, I hated it. <laughs> but, yeah, but, you, you know. just instinct instinctively hate, like, a, a fireball. And then when it looks like a pure attrition fireball, it's like... Mm. Yeah, I guess it's not. It, has, it definitely has better merit, or better merit than, than a face... First phase out. Yeah, yeah, in the context of the game, okay, like, it's not a great wizard, but is he going to get a better one? Like, at least it yeah. stopped a touchdown, basically. Yeah. And now he can he can just literally, uh, literally defensive Dakar into a 1 1 and then hopefully he keeps his players alive. It's hard, though, because they can get tentacles, so he's, got, he's just dodging away from tentacles every turn. <laughs> 
No big whoop. Doing the tree, investing the tree and getting killed as soon as possible. Dodges away and then blitzes that could have chained the guy out away from the tentacles. <laughs> Sense, uh. Oh, okay. Well, this game is definitely interesting. Yeah. I'm really glad I didn't watch it live. <laughs> I get more enjoyment out of it now. Yes, I'm. I'm glad I don't watch any games live. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, when you're, when you're casting every, everything. Yeah, exactly. It means I've just got to watch it twice and it yeah. takes a long time, doesn't it? A lot of them, a lot of them take a long time. Yeah, even as replays. Mm. You do miss out on some of the drama, of course. Yeah. yeah. I do like live some games. Some games live are great. Yeah. yeah. And others are just like pulling tea. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, <laughs> <laughs> big meanie Hancock not pulling any punches. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I mean, what I said was entirely true. I stand by it. <laughs> that was a rowdy reroll, wasn't it? What you said. I don't like that reroll. No. That reroll is horrendous. Like in the first half, yes. Now what? Yeah, that yeah. was that was very rowdy. Because, like, you've got yeah, to realise, like, rules, your yeah. best case scenario is overtime, right? Yeah, exactly. That's literally, like, that's the best thing that can happen to children is overtime. So, wasting a reroll, essentially wasting a reroll there. Not a fan. And why are Oh, it's just. Because he wanted the foul. Yeah, I can, I can foul the tree. Like, what the flip? That's not the win condition for the elves. Mm. Like, the elves expect the tree to die, and if it doesn't, yeah, great. It's not going to do anything in this matchup. Yeah. Maybe it's just overvaluing, like, the, the taking up the Noga Warriors or something. I don't know. Yeah, but yeah. Stick one on it, make a 4 plus dodge, like your challenger. 4 plus dodges are easy. <laughs> this is bread and butter, isn't it? Yeah. The only difference is there's not an uphill sack after the 4 plus dodge. <laughs> <laughs> like, That's what makes the four plus six all there as well, didn't he? I'm, I'm not sure if he bothered him. Yeah. No. no, they're both pissing away rerolls for no reason. At least with Doomadan, it's better. Like, Doomadan pissing away his rerolls is, is less bad because he's already ahead. Yeah. yeah. So if he thinks he's getting stuff out of it, he can reroll. But like, yeah, but he's not getting stuff out of that one. But yes, no. Yes. But you know, like that's the situation. Whereas Chunter, yeah, yes. just his only way he wins is by winning an overtime. Now, if he if he scores yeah. early to try and score again in normal time, he's a lunatic because it doesn't make any sense, does it? Yeah, no, 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 no. So not unless you pitch chairs the elves, which. Like, but even then, yeah, you that's... then you still just wait for overtime. So so like yeah. he has to win in overtime if he wins this game to yeah. overtime. So yeah. you you have to value your rivals more. Yeah, for sure. Like even even if he pitch chairs, yeah, all right, go ahead, have to win the hot toss, right? Get some tentacles on, glorious. Both of them were handed a reroll, and both of them were like, nah, I'm good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, exactly. Didn't want the AV roll is the only reason to it's time for that reroll. Yeah, exactly. Which, like, no, that's just <laughs> such a bad argument. Yeah, it's a terrible reason, but it's the only thing. Misclick is the other one. <laughs> <laughs> was that a misclick? Oh, that always goes down well with your opponent. <laughs> was, that, was that a misclick? <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like something Hancock would say. <laughs> <laughs> When, when, Rick, when Hancock says that, it's definitely with another intonation than when Rick says that. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Nah, I'm only joking. Hancock isn't really a nasty man. I am a big meanie, said Colon. <laughs> Oh, 
Is this guy totally safe? Yeah. <laughs> Colon stands by you. <laughs> He's a big meanie. No one cares, Colon. You're full of shit anyway. <laughs> I read that as Colon meanie then. <laughs> Just because you said Colon. <laughs> I was wondering if you'd try and uh, pressure Yeah. The, uh, like, why, the did, yeah. why did Chunter leave so much space behind in between the ball and Maybe he wanted to encourage this so he could come Yeah, that's what I was thinking when he did it at the time. Maybe, maybe he was after encouraging a bit of engagement so he'd get some hits on. Yeah. yeah, if he makes the ball totally safe here in a like big strong unit then maybe he's uh doing way well, he just fucks yeah, off and like, it's not impossible to make it safe either. Yeah. Oof. You can easily reconnect, can't you? Sick on the Irish can sing, but it's even more. I'm not sure. Going on here. Oh god. I kind of hate that <laughs> dodge blitz with the ball carrier. You know, that's a 1 in 36 to lose the game, isn't it? Instantly. Yeah. Right. Could have just moved this guy here first. Just li literally could have just done these moves first, right? Who can say? I can say. I can say. I can say that one. Making one in 36 rolls with the ball about to get surfed is mental. <laughs> yes. Mental. It was absolutely um, mental. Like, that was absolutely mental, wasn't it? That really yeah. Was. yeah. Oh, wow. Like, the thing, th this is what I don't like about using the... Uh, Oh my god! <laughs> like it was, it was always going to happen. I was confused by like the setup, the turn yeah. prior. Yeah. Positioning like, from position and, and like he had the guard Nova Warrior that you could have put in to form part of the cage, yeah. and then base, base with the beast. No, just stay in the cage. Just yeah, yeah, you have guard on both bits and stay in the cage. Yeah, yeah, that was that was insane. Living the beast, like yeah, yeah. Because, because it, like. The issue yeah. now is that, like, they're all spread out, so the elves love that. They love when you fucking spread out. Yeah. Oh, exactly. Dodges through the tentacles! <laughs> Rerolls the pickup! <laughs> dodges <laughs> through the tentacles again! What? The hands off to the tree! No, I was gonna say, hands off to the tree! <laughs> 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 Uh, I mean, I, I loved, I loved the handoff. If I'm honest with you, it was definitely the right. Play. Love a six plus handoff, I do. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, because the, the, the ball is almost always staying. Yeah, on in the, the tackle zone right? of the tree. Yeah, yeah, it was yeah. pretty decent. That, it was pretty decent. But <laughs> holy shit, um, that was funny. Yeah, that's hilarious. <laughs> like dodging through the tag, dodging away from tentacles this turn. It's just like it does not. See, like this is just a bad build, but yeah, it was a bad oh decision. God. Like that, it, the 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 beast, yeah. as, as Hancock said, you've got guard right next to the well, ball. Just keep yeah. him there. Don't don't run off the base. With the beast to even like base the board answer. Yeah, plus you're like you're on the two plus right, running the running yeah. the really stupid. Like he was in the and perfect that, like, spot. There was no the, need to move yeah, him. Yeah, for sure, just in the perfect spot. Mm. It's just, mm, like, foul appearance. Did he double one. The, double one. The foul appearance used his last reroll in the foul appearance. How how has he burned through four rerolls? I mean, I guess. He quad school then, didn't he? <laughs> Did he what? 
Yeah, well, yeah, because um, two foul appearances, then it was double one to dodge away from tents. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Double one foul appearance, double one to dodge away from tent. Uh, double one on the tentacles roll, and then double one on the dodge. <laughs> After the double two, yeah. <laughs> well, lots of ones. But, mm, I mean, yeah, no, with the handoff play, like, Tundra's only, like, edge up was way away from the... Uh, where the ball was like yeah i, I love the handoff to the, to the tree yeah it was good it's not going to work but it gets the ball and the tackles on yeah yeah. Yeah. yeah yeah whereas if you don't it just punches you away from the tree so yeah it was yeah, yeah it's fine and and like you have to make another technical stodge like yeah, no. yeah. also on, on like sure. the high roll of it working it's yeah. pretty good <laughs> yeah. yeah no i loved it it was just, it was just yeah. funny wasn't it it was just a yeah thing. it was yeah. funny but it, it's a try. oh all right <laughs> well the ball again mm. That was easy. Well, Chunter's plant to sucker him in to get hits has worked out, hasn't it? Yeah, worked <laughs> a treat. Worked a treat. A glorious space cadet. <laughs> 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 oh, and I think he could have stood this, uh, this strength guy up last turn and just didn't, and now he's going to get fouled instead. Yeah. I didn't pay enough attention last time. Mm. Yeah, because when, when he did the handoff to the tree, he hadn't stood that guy up, and I was like, oof. Oof. But he had a turn in between that as well. Yeah, maybe. He Where's the one with all the snakes? Tree Blitz! He could have based the ball, is he? No, not reach. now. If he'd powed. One, two, three, GFI, GFI. Yeah, who's going to base yeah, the ball, I guess? He, he force a 1 in 36 oh. roll. Well, in fact, force, him, <laughs> force his treat to get smashed by Claw Mighty. Maybe he's just going to run away after he blitzed. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> oh! Oof. Just, just <laughs> quick reminder, both these guys started the half with four re-rolls. Yes. <laughs> Are they both out? One and zero. One no, unbelievable. One. unbelievable. That is unbelievable, isn't it? Yeah, I, like in the first half, maybe you can reroll that punch on the tree, but like it's you can't. You play. can't reroll it in the second half. No, no way, no Jose. Way, no way. But with the, when your plan is to foul it as well, it's like it's yeah. not worth it. No. And when you're down, like that that's the biggest yeah. thing I think. Yeah, that's the, the other thing. The best case scenario for Chunter is getting to overtime. So it reroll conservation is paramount. Yeah, like imagine being two rerolls up here and then you're suddenly like somewhat of a favourite, maybe. Yeah. I mean you're favourite, but if you lose the toss you're still just gonna lose because he's he's got elves. <laughs> 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 might might just be a hangover from playing a lot of dash, might it? I don't know. Yeah, maybe, maybe. Back in six. Three send offs. Yeah, that's a good point. He's got he's got a mighty blow hit from the tree. He's got a one turn chance. Not much because we've got tents holding tents at the back, so there's there's not much chance of a one turn. And now, but like that's the thing, right? The one turn chance is basically non-existent versus five tents. Got to make three technical rolls at minus two strength. It's the ultimate, ultimate anti anti one turn team, isn't it? Five technical noble. Oh. <laughs> so, are you going to GFI to hit with a tree? Probably, right? He's not, he's not going to. Lame. I would totally GFI'd. <laughs> Because like it's so much, it's so much better to cast this guy than this guy, isn't it? I guess not. He's only mighty yeah. blow. I guess he's only mighty blow, and that's a wrestle. So yeah, it's just... mm, yeah. I forget that they don't actually have claw <laughs> against anybody you care about. Um, by the way, uh, I just complete side note. Um, was a little bit sad that my date. Um, was over 
Then I went to the store and realized that they brought in like the big vanilla, vanilla cokes again. So now I'm just super fucking happy. I have vanilla coke. Good. Oh, he's lost the toss. There's chumps. So. Well, I guess. That is it, <laughs> yeah. Not really. Not really. He's got. He's got the, the tentacles. Can do things, right? The tentacles can do things. No rerolls. Yeah, the tentacles are what's scary now, right? No mm. rerolls. Um. This. Uh, I like. Think there's a fair amount of tackle. Uh, He's got two uh, two different um, beasts, and then we tackle one and uh, wrestle. So it's not over. <laughs> Don't say it's over. <laughs> <laughs> it never stops being funny. <laughs> no, it doesn't, does it? It's tricky though to defend because obviously, if you let the Nurgle warriors get punched, then like you've kind of, like there's nothing better than chevrons. Really, is there for two turns? No, no. And they can hit one and then get behind you and, you know, three of your tentacles are irrelevant, aren't they then? Like the beast isn't doing anything because he's stuck on the tree. And then the two on the other side aren't doing anything and one's been knocked down, so... You can cover the back line. It's perfect for the one turn, uh, Gideon, but... It is perfect. You can cover it with four, right? With four tentacles. I'll pause it here. If you've only got four tentacles, you can completely cover the pitch with tentacles because you can just mm -hmm. put them there, there, and then you can put three players in the middle, right? So that yep. whatever they'll do, they'll have to dodge from, once from tentacles. But if you've got five, then they've got, like, whatever they do, they've got to, like, dodge three times from tentacles. So it's, like, it's pretty amazing to have five. Yeah. Quick snap is pretty... Glorious for doing it. Yeah. Every little helps, definitely. Why did he choose to leave the tree there? I, I guess he really wants to tie up the beast. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Why, why haven't you based the uh, pesty with one of our best players? Um, I don't know. Could you just use something else not as good? Yeah, they're yeah. faster, I guess. Faster, they're faster, aren't they? They're a lot faster. So they just want to win through and screen. Mm. This game's over after this turn, isn't it? He's not getting punched. True. Yeah, because that um, water answer is move plus. Uh, move plus. <laughs> Yeah, you need them. You need them down the field. So yeah, I think that's that's fine. There was an argument to be made for blocking with a tree and then getting them move the strength up around, wasn't there? Yeah, I think that was. I, I like blocking with the tree and getting the strength up free. Yeah, because you, yeah, you want. Yeah, tentons. exactly. Tag the tag the last tense. Then it's proper. But now this technical is only equal strength with the with the ball, so it's not even really particularly well, I mean, dangerous. It's but it's another on. dice roll with no rewards. Yeah. So yeah, I would have definitely like the tree pit hit, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Probably a GFI maybe to tag. But yeah, definitely worth trying to tag that technical man. I mean, if we're saying we're scared of one thirty six, it's like this is waivers. Oh yeah. <laughs> Yeah, because how, how is he clearing that? It's a good question. I think there's literally no good way of playing that. I mean, Does he need to get him behind to the left? Yeah, I think this this arch like, guy, this arch guy, right? We've been spaffing our rerolls like the entire game, and yet, why are we not rerolling that? Yeah. Because mm. it's it's quite odds on for him to score it, and you've got to do everything you can to make it as hard as possible. Yeah, yeah. to reroll that. I think it, yeah. I think it is as hard as possible. Like yeah, yeah, that's the square you want to fill, right? But getting to that square, like you have to roll. What? That's a stupid amount of dice. It's not. It's not at all. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You just go there. 
Wait, where? Where? This catch. You got the Archie five. This catcher one, two, is, three, is that, four, five, the... six, seven, eight. Did, where and did you leap? Where did you leap from? Did you You're not from? leaping. What are you, what are you? This this catcher always oh, moves seven. It just goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then you blitz, right? That's an easy score. So so Chunter was GFI into here, wasn't he? Uh, where, where, yes. was yeah, 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 that's fair. Uh, yeah, yeah, so then the ball carrier, I'm an idiot. Yeah. So yeah, so so that was the defensive. So it would have only added a two plus to uh to do Madan's role, but then obviously then it, you would have had to come here. It was a two plus away from tackle, and then if he. Then he's got to dodge through the tackle as well, so it was a pretty good square to yeah. be in, wasn't it? I guess you yeah. could have you could have also GFI to there, but then it's a then it's kind of a one D. I I really I like just, re rolling in that now. Yeah, yeah, you're yeah, really. Yeah, he's got to re roll because he's losing the next yeah. turn. Yeah. 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 yeah, Hancock's absolutely correct. He's <laughs> literally losing the next turn. You have to re roll yeah. it because <laughs> if he gets to that square, like it's really fucking difficult for Dumadam to clear this. Yeah. Like really fucking difficult. You are literally about to lose the next turn, so yes, that's when you should use a reroll for sure. <laughs> Not when you're punching a tree. Yeah. When you're there going go. to lose the next turn. Gosh, done. Yeah. Fence, better than guard? Not yet. <laughs> No, it, it's it's good though. It's like I, I'm okay with it after, like you know, after guard. You know. After guard, hundred percent. Yeah, gotcha. Yeah. And there's a lot of situations as well, like where you, you cut off like nice blitz angles for elves and stuff because of guard. So I don't know, man. I mean, it, it looked fun, but um, just didn't didn't bring the goods, unfortunately. Yeah, I mean that. That's... It's not better than guard. Like there's, like, it's just. I mean, it, it is when you're ahead, right? It is when you're. Yes. Ahead. It's definitely yeah, exactly. better when you're ahead. That's the thing. If if you've got eleven and your opponent's got eight, it tentacles. I would instantly replace. Guard on all of my warriors with tentacles. If I could do that, I would. Every single game, almost. Almost every single game, once I'm ahead and I'm, like, say, you know, 80% to win or whatever, then instantly switch all my guards for tentacles. If I could do that, I would totally would. Because it's it's great then, because you just, you just can't get away and stuff. And, like, even in bash mirrors, if, if you're banging a few out, once, once, like you just totally shut them down, and, and they're screwed now. You, they're just like, well, you just hit and claw them at every turn because you can't, you can't dodge or anything. Like it's incredible. Once you're ahead, yeah. the problem yeah, is it doesn't do anything when you're behind or level, and that's that's the real problem with it. His, his team was, was when built. Behind, like the guard, when when you're ahead, the guard does so much in, in exactly that, right? Yeah, you can dodge away, but like you're bad, you can dodge away. I mean. <laughs> I mean, Gad is um, still great, obviously, yeah. On the bash on bash matchups, like, Chunter's team gets annihilated with the 2k kill team. Yeah. Yes. Yes, you don't have fucking Claw Bomb. Like, yes, you don't have Claw Bomb or it's, it's It was a weird team to. It's not what I'd want to be facing another You got an team. awesome bracket for it, though, right? It was, did, it was yeah, in yeah. for a load of, like, Aji matches to come. Yeah. Um, I mean, obviously, it was a bit unfortunate here, but I think. He also, he also like they both of them to be fair, but like you can obviously yeah, yeah, you can yeah, afford to make a few more mistakes on on Woody's than you can on yeah. Nurgle. Yeah, if you yeah. misposition on Nurgle, then you can get taken advantage of so easily. And, yeah, exactly. Like that's the thing, right? The game is Chantress to lose, right? So every mistake from Chantress is gonna be way worse than a mistake to do with that. I mean that's a, that's a bit extreme. It's it's yeah. not, it's it's like it was it was a favorite obviously, but it wasn't his to lose. And and it's it is like it is the aspect of bash and, and dash, isn't it? Like it's funny as well in in stark contrast to all of it, you know his usual games with Skaven. Skaven can completely balls up, and then next turn, oh guess what? I'll just move these fine. guys yeah, nine, yeah. movement nine, and everything's fine. And like you can do that without Woodies as well. The same kind of team, like you just reposition, yeah. no problem. But dwarves yeah. and, and you know Nurgle and stuff like that. If you if you balls up, you've just lost the game. So it's uh, yeah, you have to be yeah, consistent right, yeah, hearing yeah. constantly. Maybe that's why I'm with like if, if any any mistake will be will be exasperated by exactly that. It's gonna be really fucking difficult to recover. Like, yeah, maybe they did colon, but like you, you can't high roll guard, can you? <laughs> yeah, no, yeah. I'm not being nasty. Genuinely, you, you you can't high roll guard, can you? It always does what it says on the tin. Yeah, on tens, you're turns, always oh, okay. it's the opposite that uh, high roll. Yeah, D D Daedal does sound like he's in the loo. Yeah, something happened to Daedal's microphone somehow. Um, 
But yeah, yes, sorry, I'm, I'm fixing my dinner. I'm sorry. Uh-huh, no problem. Um, yeah, that's the thing. Like guard is guard is just great, isn't it? And it's one of the few things that does things on like both players' turns as well, and like yeah, affects yeah. other people's actions. It's it's incredible. Like you know, blocks great. It's offensive and defensive, but you're not you're not necessarily using it every turn. Whereas guard is like always on. It's it's unbelievable, isn't it? It's an unbelievably good skill. But yeah. Once you're ahead, you know, tentacles, a lot of the times I would switch guard from tentacles. Yeah, no, yeah. maybe not every time. Yeah. But a lot of games, like, you know, that's people's only chance, isn't it? It's like rolling some dice and, and tentacles just... It, nothing gives you more value against elves than tentacles. Like, just... Yeah, I, re- I really don't hate, like, the fact that he had tentacles and everything. It's just, like, the rest of the team was lacking a bit for... Yeah. And it despite also, being uh, two thousand four hundred TV, yeah. yeah. <laughs> also, with the, with the tents, like as we've just seen, like you you have to make sure it's in the right place all the time. Yeah, yeah. It has to be in the correct position on the pitch all the time to get the most out of it. Yeah. And and like the beast in the first half, like it was so punishing that it was stupid. Um, but like he didn't even know that it was stupid. Like the first time he had a, an opportunity to have that ball on tents. Yeah. Yeah, I really yes. liked re-rolling that hit, and then I really hated his activation of the beast later. But um, there you go, he got away with it, didn't he? <laughs> anyway, right, should end the YouTube video after that insane conversation about tentacles for like ten minutes. <laughs> Thank you. It's, it's not insane because we're never gonna have it again, right? Yeah, like, yeah, it, good. Yeah, yeah, no. One. It's fun. No, he might, do. He do might have a bit in his teeth. Yeah, no, he wants to prove us all wrong. Yeah. Go for it, yeah. yeah. And if yeah. if Stone Troll if Stone Troll joins uh, Blood Bowl two, then you know somebody might actually win with it. <laughs> hey, <laughs> <laughs> thank you very much, Dirtle and Hancock, for joining us in the booth. Absolutely glorious as always. Yeah, thank you so much. Welcome, Ma, welcome. <laughs> and thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic. <laughs>